Hi there, this is Ace Guzman, and I want to thank you so much for stopping by this video today. If it's your first time here, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss a beat when we go live and when we upload new content just like this. In today's video, I am going to share with you my Pix Teller review. That's right, it has been over quite a few years and i actually been using it every single day for almost over two years now since i bought it at the diamond level and i want to share with you today my honest review about pix teller what i've learned over the years of using it and how i've been using it to actually scale up and ace i like that my graphic designing and i'm going to tell you something i am not a photoshop expert by any means i couldn't even have the patience to learn photoshop and i found a way to literally take my freelancing graphic design to a whole nother level and i started helping private clients with their designs i even got paid to make a banner for somebody who actually needed their advertisement offline for their aquarium business using this program and then on top of that i was able to make a additional affiliate income from marketing my services to create Facebook timeline covers. Um, oh my God, I just can't wait to show you. Would you guys like to see it? I can't wait to show you. So let's go over to the screen, log into my PixTeller account, and I'm gonna show you some of my designs, okay? And then I'll give you some pointers. Of course, I'm not gonna leave you hanging like that. I'm gonna definitely share some pointers with you of what you can do with PixTeller that you didn't know about. So stay tuned for those bonuses. Okay, so let's go to the screen. I'm gonna share with you my PixTeller account. Now, over here on this side of the screen, this is my PixTel account. And as you can see, under this account, if I click on the lines, you'll see that I'm a Diamond member. And if you don't have the paid version of the Diamond level for uh, PixTeller, be sure to click below this video in the description. There is a link there to get your account started. Believe me, I was like a free account member for a while. I was, you know, literally using it and creating five designs at a time and I got tired of that. And then I realized that I was using this more than its actual competitors like Canva and Crello. I was using this more than Canva and I was like, forget Canva, I'm gonna use this for now on. And I like this because since I've been using this, I noticed that my graphic resolutions are absolutely stunning, stunning when I tell you. They stand out more than a Canva image. I don't know why. <laughs> Pixteller got it down with the pixels, let me tell you. That's what it is. So let's take a look over here. We're going to log into my account. Let's go to my folders. Now I want to show you something. I like to organize my stuff. So if you are a graphic designer and you haven't been organizing your designs, I highly recommend that you start organizing them. If you want to put them in alphabetical order, that's another idea you can do. But I use it in the order that I actually am creating. So I actually have different folders that I made. And if you don't know how to do this, it's very, very simple. All you do is you go right over here to the plus sign and select add folder. And then you start typing in the name of your folder. So let's say this is a test, put test and then you hit the check mark and immediately it's going to create a folder called test. So that is the quick way to create a folder and you can start moving your designs in there. So let me show you my Facebook post. Now I have a folder full of designs and what I've been doing is using, you know, Pixel to create little graphics like this for my Facebook account. And sometimes I share this stuff on Instagram too through my mobile device. So I use this for my Facebook groups, for my Facebook profile. I created invitations. I created quotes. Look at this. This is Cool, I, I stepped up my game. Let me tell you, the last time I did a review on Pixteller, you probably don't remember, it probably was like last year or so, and my designs were kind of like antiquated. I'm a lot better now <laughs> since then, but this is really beautiful. I've been able to create beautiful quotes with my monogram. I've got my logo, I've got my watermark there. Um, let me show you some other things I've been able to do with, look at this, I've been able to put myself in my images and create quotes and give advice for marketing just like this and just upload it right to my Facebook post and boom, I get tons of engagement. It's absolutely wonderful. I mean, look at the pixels on this. It's stunning, stunning. So let me go back over here, click the back browser there. And uh, look, I even did one for Rich, my partner Rich, right? Gotta have the guy in there, right? So how cool is this? Like when we do like our theme for the week, we'll do like give advice Wednesday or something like that. And we actually have images like this and we follow a theme. So this is an idea for you when it comes to branding yourself, you wanna use PixTeller for something like this, okay? 
Now, let's go to another folder. I'm going to go back to designs. And here's my other folder. This one right here is um, List Building Mastery. This is through uh, Rich's program. I'm actually not yet putting my designs in there because I haven't started working on that, but it will be coming soon. Um, we have our hot seat. So we've been doing like our thumbnails. This is how I've been making those thumbnails you guys have been seeing. These are the thumbnails. This is where I do it. Do it right here in Pixteller. So we use this when we actually go live and we do our Friday hot seat. Everybody knows about hot seat, right? And we use this to put up there for our video thumbnails. So how cool is that? Um, here's another design I made right here in Pixteller. Look at this. Ah, is awesome. All I do is just create the image, grab a couple of, of rectangles, and then just kind of like, you know, squeeze in the pictures. I mean, super duper easy for me. I even was able to create the background. Look at that. I got the nice transparent kind of like faux background with Rich back there with me on the beach. And you wouldn't even know unless you look hard. <laughs> so I got that right there. Let's go back to my templates, my designs. Here we go right here, YouTube thumbnails. These are all the YouTube thumbnails I've made over the years. Look how gorgeous and stunning these are, okay? And I'm telling you, like, you can create so many wonderful things on Pixteller. I've seen some people who use Pixteller, and to be honest with you, in my opinion, you know, it depends on what kind of a marketing you're doing. I mean, some people want to do plain Jane. Other people want to amp it up like this. This is the way I design my, I like my stuff to jump right onto your screen and go boom you know like wow that looks awesome that's powerful i love the colors i love you know playing with different fonts and i love playing with different textures so pig style will allow you to do that yeah absolutely so let's go over here Take a look over here. Now we have webinar slides. Now I've been using Pixeller for my webinar slides. I mean, I got a, a coaching program that's worth over $6,000 and I've been able to sell it all out. Literally, I sold all out from the beginning of the year and I was using Pixeller to create the slides and the designs for it and everything. I mean, this is super cool. Um, here's our newest one right here for our webinar that we have coming up. This right here has got hot seat on it and you know we got to advertise, it's beautiful. So we've got that going on. I mean, this is a lot, a lot of fun. Signature graphics. Now check this out. What I have done is I actually taken clients and you know they pay me to make this and I just create signatures with just font and with a transparent background. So like this is super cool because like when you create like emails and you start doing your email marketing and you want to put your signature line, you could do it right in Pixteller with the font and then just download it like this and look at that. You can just hit download PNG. Once you download it, here comes your image. You just save your image, and then when you're ready to, you know, post it somewhere, uh, you can actually do that. So let me just show you real quick. And I'm only pressed for so much time, but I want to make sure that I show you this. So let's say I'm gonna. This is my letter or something like that, and I go to insert, and I'm gonna go to image, upload from my computer because I'm gonna take it from my desktop. Go to quick access, and let me grab that signature. Look at that. Boom. Just like that. Imagine if you had a letter or an email broadcast that you had to send to your list and you wanted to like kind of make it look really sexy. All you have to do is just boom, put in your, your fancy signature, you know, script. Cool, right? So I, I did that. Uh, <laughs> okay, what else am I going to show you? Mm, oh, yes, welcome graphics. Now, for those of you who are involved in network marketing, those of you who are involved with um, different types of home-based business programs, direct sales, home party plans, um, affiliate marketing, if you do welcome graphics, some of the programs out there that kind of make the graphics look kind of, uh, you know, they're not like punchy, you know, they're not welcoming. Here's a cool way to do it. You can literally create a welcome graphic or rank up graphics for your network marketing opportunity. How cool is this? Put your logo in there, put the company logo, you know, with their permission, of course, <laughs> and then make the picture of the person that gave you permission to take their photo and then bam, you say, welcome to the team, right? Or, hey, congratulations for ranking up the diamond, right? So you can do things like that. And I was able to create these beautiful, stunning graphics for my team. <laughs> so let's go over here. Told you I've been busy for the, over the years. Okay, so we got custom Facebook timeline covers. Now this is my newest project. I've been doing this for uh, quite some time now. And I definitely have come a long, long way. I mean, my graphic design used to go from like this. I used to do these type of like, you know, plain Jane kind of, you know, graphics. And now I'm stepping it up. And I'm actually able to do it now like this. Woo! How about that, right? I got I can play with different types of designs here. Um, this is one of my latest, my personal favorites for this client that I did. And uh, absolutely beautiful. And you would think that that was done on Photoshop. 
but it's actually done in pig's teller. Yeah. So I want to tell you that don't underestimate this review when I tell you that pig's teller is the way to go. You should definitely use pig's teller and have fun with it. And if you have any questions and you'd like me to go over anything per se of pig's teller, you want to know how to do a specific type of, you know, uh, special effect or something when it comes to designing, just let me know in the comments below. That would be better for, you know, for me to figure out because then once I'm learning, you learn as well. And then I can share with you what I discovered, right? Um, one more thing too, I want to share with you guys is, uh, let's see here. I have, uh, let me see, Pinterest pins. If you have a Pinterest account, did you know that you could make literally those long, beautiful pins for your Pinterest account? I did this and I was able to sell just from making my images like this pop. I was able to sell my items on my Pinterest account. Monetize. Hello, affiliate marketing. It's the way to go. Okay. So that's all that I got to share with you guys today. I want to thank you so much for stopping by. And listen, I want to tell you something. Pix Teller is a great great graphic design program you can use it for free but i highly recommend if you want the advanced features like this let's say if i clicked on this right here and you see the advanced features like this with playing with the colors and going through advanced like this linear radial and then you can start you know using like different you know um advanced colors and you can change things around and such you won't be able to do that in the free account you can only do that in the paid account, okay? So make sure that you know the differences between the free and the paid. The free will only allow you to make five images, and then after that, they're going to have to upgrade, and then you won't be able to do it. So make sure you use this on the Diamond account. I'll put the link below this video for you, so that way you can actually do that. And uh, I welcome you to using PixTeller compared to all the other programs that are out there. And for those of you who don't have a paint job in your finger, a little paintbrush in your finger, you don't have the skill set, that's why I found PixTeller because I couldn't really have the patience to learn Photoshop. I saw everybody learning Photoshop. I was like, I don't have the time. I got to get stuff done now. This is very good for people who are total beginners, have novices, and they don't know nothing about designing graphics. You could do it right here. I have my whole entire team using this. So I highly recommend those of you leaders who are watching this review with me, Ace Guzman, Tell your team to start using this instead of Canva. You won't regret it, okay? With that being said, I want to thank you so much for watching this video today. And if you liked and enjoyed the content, be sure to comment. Leave me a great comment below. I appreciate I look at every comment. I reply to every comment. And also give me a thumbs up and click the notification bell so you don't miss a beat when I go live next time on another video. Thank you so much. My name is Ace Guzman, and I'll see you on the other side. Oh, by the way, don't forget to click the link below this video for more information about how to become a top affiliate marketer and learn about affiliate marketing the way Rich and I teach compared to anybody else. No one teaches digital marketing like Ace and Rich. Okay, see you later next time. Bye.